Today is the day. Millions of households across the nation have missed their MasterCard. Mothers are in panic, worrying if they're going to be able to pay for their child's uh, lunch boxes because he has went ahead and spent all that money, drained their checking account on stubs for Andrew McCutcheon. Hopefully, <laughs> he's at least a good enough card to warrant bankruptcy. And, you know, he might get grounded in the process, but at least have a very good card to use. So we have a lot of stuff today. We have a new pack in the store. We have, oh, so much stuff to talk about. So what if we actually started talking about it? Leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel. And let's go ahead and witness everybody's future most hated card to face, I hope to God. There he is, Andrew McCutcheon. Cutch. All right, baby, come on. Be good, be good, be good, be good, be good. Holy shit. Oh my fucking God. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm gonna say he's pretty damn good. 116, 106 against righties. When 25, 115 against those south against those southpaws. Uh, he starts with 94 fielding. Kind of lame decision. To, uh, like, could, would it kill you to give him plus one uh, so he could have diamond at quarter? Who cares? It doesn't make a difference. Uh, 87 speed out of the box. Um, very good card. Uh, my nose is itching a lot. God damn it. Um, <laughs> but very good card here. Maybe McCutcheon's just giving me allergies from being so, so good. Who knows? Um, I'll be honest, uh, whatever price it is, it's probably worth it. There's no quirks on here, uh, so that's good to know. Any current players with retro finders, they're not going to get them. Uh, but yeah, uh, I don't think you really could have asked for much more. We'll see. Uh, as far as vouchers go, I figured Babe was not going to be one. They're going to ask for a bit more. Uh, Jackie is a voucher, as you know. anybody with uh, working um, frontal cortex probably could have predicted. Let's just go ahead and see about how much you're going to need. Finest cards is eight. That was my guess. Currently, we have six. So, you know, get the new Houston Street, get a couple from the event. Bada bing, bada boom. There you go. Let's go ahead and see. All right. That's pretty fair. Fuck you, man. 16. Son of a bitch. All of them? Really? Uh, maybe not all of them, as I'm witnessing right now. Okay. Four more. So, 40K. Uh, Takashi's kind of a lot. Milestone. Okay, I, I need one more from here. That's not bad. Signature. Uh, just seven. Wow. Just seven. And a free Minoso's coming out today. Awards. 16. We're hitting on that. Uh, we're hitting on that. Prime cards, 20. Uh, so it looks like you need uh, about most of them. All but like two. Thank God. Okay, you only needed one more face of the franchise. If you invested on these, good God, you are a mad lad. Jesus Christ, you have a, you're smarter than I. Uh, prospect, they asked for two more. 42. Okay, I'm one off. Again, there's a new pack. We'll talk about that. Monthly, you need 35. I'll be there. Second half. That's another tough one. Second half in Takashi. You're going to get a lot of people, I presume. These are softballs. What the hell? These are easier than shit. Uh, okay, so it's just really those two. I guess I'm a little off on All-Star as well. Interesting. Okay, so 75 is kind of a lot. All right. So I'd imagine the catch-up for most people is going to be... And again, you can skip one, four, eight... Uh, if I'm not wrong, 4, 8, 12, 16, uh, 19. You can skip one. I would recommend you skip Jackie, at least for now. Um, good cards in there, just probably not the most worth it. So there you go. You can skip one, but I didn't anticipate so much Takashi you would need. But, you know, not too bad. I don't think it's abhorrently expensive for how good the card is i think it's a very good card and worth you going and getting it uh that's yeah the houston street yeah of course he goes for like 50k son of a bitch all that for you never to be used i mean it's pretty good 125 maxed out hit nine that's a little bold um you've got four pitches um i appreciate the uh the sub man uh doesn't exactly throw hard not gonna break the radar gun 
Supposedly, control doesn't matter too much is what I've been hearing amongst the community. BB9 is a much bigger attribute for that. So we'll see. An okay card. It has maxed out break. Houston Street should be solid. Um, but we have a new pack, a flash sale um, for the toolbox. Oh, okay. Interesting, I guess. Uh, we have Big Peen Veen, who looks like, uh, appreciate the Rima, uh, the Risa Empire. Uh, he, he looks pretty yikes. Um, maybe doesn't have that big of a peen after all. He's overcompensating. Ella De La Cruz, 98, 110. He's a switch hitter, which is going to make it better, of course, with the 90 contact left. A good card. You know, it's a good card overall. That being said, Alec Thomas. Uh, he's got good contact, lower power. Again, like uh, Austin Martin's better than this card, and he got released two months ago. Um, okay, Josh John. He looks good. Okay, he looks good. Again, these are going to go towards quick sell price. He can play about anywhere, maybe even catcher or pitcher, if you asked real nicely. Uh, 112, 104 contact, power, 94, 98. Um, the fielding isn't... You know, you can get it up to gold shield at every spot at P4. Good card. I, I like that one. Taj Bradley, uh, of course, they didn't give him an actual usable pitch here. Um, you know, he throws relatively hard there. Uh, no outlier, I presume, based on 86 velo. Uh, he looks okay. Not really a reason to use him. Uh, let's get into the big boys. You know, Noel V. Marte. All right. 104, 100 against righties, 98, 112 against lefties, gold defense, uh, 87 speed. It was a good card. Good card. I still think the Dansby is probably better. Same thing with Cattell. But this is, uh, we'll see. Oh, we might have a new S tier Marte at shortstop. He's damn good. Um, for the price, pretty solid. Okay, that's a good one. Good way to start off. No sinker, but he does have outlier, I would guess. Outlier one on the four-seamer. Uh, rare breed. It seems like only people can have outlier on sinker these days. Um, the BB9 at 62 is just a fucking killer, man. I mean, that that's right up there with Michael Myers and the 50 fucking movies. Uh, I just saw the trailer for the next one. How exactly do they keep getting away with making the same Halloween movie time and time again? Who watches those? Exactly. Um... I don't know. The BB-9 certainly makes my cock soft. Um, Jesus Christ. Look at Diego Cartaya right here. What you doing all out here with all this contact? Double PCI'd up on a Friday afternoon. Hella contact. Wow. 102-104. Good power. 92 arm. The block is little, but who cares? Um, fuck. Yeah. I, this card is cheaper than Napoli. Napoli's probably still better, but he's the second best catcher in the game right now. Jesus, I, I didn't expect such a good card. Okay, uh, roster update. Yeah, a lot of stuff going on right here. Kind of forgot that's even a thing. Uh, Aaron Judge. I'll remove myself before anybody cries in the comment section. Um, plus 40 base running aggressiveness. Um, <laughs> huge upgrade there. Yeah, I, I guess he didn't do anything noteworthy. His nine home runs in the last update period wasn't warranting of any sort of offensive upgrade there. Great. Um, did they not? You have to be fucking joked. Arm accuracy. <laughs> oh, there's no shots. The overhaul is updating people's base running aggressiveness. Are you fucking kidding me uh, his arm accuracy uh renfro so they didn't change any offensive attributes they're all <laughs> oh fuck dude I, I i it just shocks me every time julio goes diamond here um you know it's good i'm glad they're catching up with this stuff like michael harris a big plus seven you know, that, that's great. But how the fuck are you going to call this a roster update? Like, if you're not going to update any offensive stats. Did nobody hit? I <laughs> Did nobody take an at-bat since the last update? I don't know. It certainly doesn't look like they actually changed every player in the game here. 
it, it really doesn't, at least to me. But what do I know, I guess? Dance be a big plus three here. Um, yeah. I'm disappointed, to say the least. Um, great, though. I, I'm happy that they are changing some of these things. Uh, just really shitty if you were looking to make investments. Donaldson's been great defensively. Absolutely. He deserves an upgrade. They didn't downgrade anybody for anything. They just seemed to boost people up. Uh, the positivity movement is immense. Glaber Torres goes gold. A big one for him. Trevor Story, hey, I did say that was going to happen, so... <laughs> There you go. Uh, Vlad actually plays a pretty good 1B. I appreciate that one right there. Um, doesn't look like anything too major. Holy shit. Alejandro Kirk goes up 5. Trevino goes gold. I could have told you that was going to happen. Adley, big uh, gold upgrade for him. Jesus, yeah. Look at Kirk. Um, <laughs> it just catapults into diamond right here with fielding upgrades. Uh, then pitchers will have to see. Apparently they changed pitches. With some of these guys changed velo, which is cool. Um, uh, Verlander, they, they downgraded him. Same thing with Corbin Burns, minus one control. Whatever, man. Okay, roster update, I guess. A huge overhaul. A paradigm shift in how the game operates. Uh, we do have the Mini Minoso program. I kind of forgot that came out. You know what? He's pretty good. Wow. Good card, especially for free. Uh, he's... Like, a free Roberto Clemente, essentially. You know, the good fielding. Not as good an arm, but the power, the contact. It gives you shades of Clemente. So, I like it. You know, very good. You can play third base at a gold shield out of the box. You'll get to diamond at left field. This is a very good card that came out for free. And again, if you're looking for cards for the program, all you're going to have to do is missions uh, and moments uh, for the collection. Uh, I should preface if I you know, remember how to speak. Uh, we do have some new... Tops now cards. Nelson Velasquez. Hey, uh, you know, it looks very balanced. 94, 95, 93, 98. Pretty good. Uh, for these tops now cards, that's about as much as you can ask for. Um, a lot of these guys may be for team builds. Not that there's any incentive to use them. Uh, but JJ's looking mighty fine here. We have JJ, two JJs back to back. Wow, look at that. Um, you know, he, he looks the worst out of the bunch. Go figure. Uh, any collection? There is a headliner pack, set 33. Uh, a new silver card coming into your inventory. All right. Uh, then I guess POTM, I am imagining if they have a schedule update, will be next week. Uh, roster and more con... Uh, okay, Shark Map is next week, noted. July monthly awards on the 3rd, so that is going to be on Wednesday. The big content drop is... Uh, so that should be cool. That should be cool. Um, yeah, and then the Craig Biggio is going to be obtainable here. A any other big picture stuff that I missed here? Uh, Hater is outlier too, Seamer. I don't know if I've seen that ever before. That's kind of cool. So, yeah, the big picture here. Uh, two free... Uh, absolutely not free McCutcheon. One free 99. And then a uh, free Minoso. But McCutcheon looks great. I'm looking forward to getting him. And uh, we should have a tip video and gameplay up shortly. I hope. Leave a like down below. Let me know what you guys think about the update here. Uh, the huge overhaul for the roster update. Are you getting McCutcheon and everything in between? Uh, leave a like. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys have a great day. Dragons out to eat.